This is our PLC, it's our projector console, and this computer right here is basically keeping track of every single frame that's running through the projector right now, and it's extremely important for us. We can uh, kick a show off manually here if we want to, but the biggest thing that it does for us is by keeping track of that frame count. If we're in the back room doing print inspection or getting something set up for distribution, we don't have to run out here really quickly to make sure that we're here at the end of a show. It'll automatically shut the show down for us without us even having to worry. We're standing in front of our sound and automation rack here in the uh, projectionist booth. All of these uh, units here that have the green lights on them, these are our amplifiers for our 15,000 watt sound system inside the theater. We're actually running two separate sound systems. We have one that's mounted on the back of the flat screen and a completely separate one that mounts on the back of the dome screen that actually rides with it as it moves up and down. The sound system uh, is actually pumped through this digital computer here. It's all digital sound. It's constantly keeping track of every frame that's rolling through the projector upstairs, just like the PLC did. Uh, as it keeps track of every single frame, it helps make sure that the digital sound is perfectly in sync with the movie. Right next to it here is our Spice computer. Uh, this computer is basically the entire script for the entire movie. It starts out with putting up certain lighting commands. Those lights will dim down at a certain time when we tell them to. We can make the dome rotate through this computer. It's all done with timing sequences. So everything is completely automated and it's all talking to each other all through the rotor that's spinning upstairs inside the projector. If you remember that digital sound computer that we showed you before, there's a spot on there where we can actually click a button to flip over to a dubber system. The dubber system is uh, our backup sound source here at the Science Museum. Uh, it was used at the old museum and we actually brought it over as a backup system. As you're walking in from the omni Q area, you look through the glass, you may wonder what the heck is that thing in that room over there. This is it, this is the dubber. It runs a 35 millimeter magnetic soundtrack. Uh, we have one for every movie. Uh, it's basically just like a giant cassette tape. So we'll put the movie on, or we'll put the soundtrack on there, have it ready to go. It'll play with the entire movie. At the end of the movie, we have to rewind it just like a cassette tape. It takes about four minutes to do that, and then we'll have it set up for the next movie. And again, it's just a backup sound system in case we were to ever lose our digital. That way we don't lose a show.